under no circumstance should my i'm like freaked out right now what the fuck i'm depressed or isn't everybody right now because what the hell is going on in the world <laughs> A ton of people that are doing this whole self quarantining thing, like you should, the social dis, social distance, social distancing, everything. Ah, bleh. Especially with the social distancing thing and everything. So I am 100% sure that I am not the only person out here right now feeling that, feeling just kind of weirdly isolated and kind of depressed because of that. So I figured this could be a little vlog where you guys could hang out with me and we could try to get inspired together because I do find that depression hits the worst when I am feeling uninspired, but honestly, there's a reason for it this time and it's not really in my control. But you know what is in my control? My attitude, so that's what I'm gonna do is just spend my time today trying to make myself feel better, even though it's already like 3 p.m. because that's how all my depression vlogs are always going to start for the rest of forever because I like to be nice to myself and sleep like a motherfucker, so. Let's see where this goes. I apologize for this terribly yellow lighting. As you can probably tell, my face feels very swollen. Like, I don't know, does this happen to anybody else? Especially when you're not in a good mood, your face just like doesn't move as easily as normal. So I'm gonna wash my face. So like it's moving again so I can smile and do what I need to do, you know? I did already eat today, but rumor has it you're supposed to eat more than once a day, so I should probably eat something again. Once again, when you're depressed, not feeling inspired, that also means you're not really feeling an appetite. At least for me, this is just obviously my perspective, my life. I don't really know what to eat, so I'm just gonna whop something together and see what happens. What are you doing? <laughs> Keep seeing headlines come up for places that obviously affected by this whole virus thing. And I keep seeing places that are like, you know, Utah hit with like an earthquake or like people lost power somewhere. And I'm just like, talk about the end of the world feeling. I like to compare people and what we're going through, but when you're going through a tough time just cause you're like not allowed to go see other people. And then you see things like that happen. You're like, you know what? fuck it i'm good i'll just stay at home but if your house like crumbles from a fucking earthquake during all this like uh i just i send so much love to anybody that is affected by all of this like this is just a lot yeah these pretty flowers for myself the other day real sunflowers it's only march very excited i ended up making soup and leftover bananas and peanut butter on the side very excited Woo! Also turned on all my aesthetically pleasing lights that I have. Like doing little things like the lights and making them cool and just, I don't know, just little extra touches like that really just improve my mood. So I'm gonna go and just sit, watch YouTube, eat my food and just chillax and do things that inspire me. You can go outside. Instead of being sad and stressed and being like, oh. Joke. Under no circumstance should my I'm like freaked out right now. What the fuck? So out of no circumstance, should my Alexa have just been playing the kids bop version of Old Time Road. What the fuck? That just came on out of nowhere. I'm literally watching a YouTube video, and I can guarantee you that that was not said. What the fuck? I can't believe I just got that on here. Looking a little bit more human because I put mascara on, but I just wanted to make a quick reminder to everybody that it's okay to go outside. I know everything is telling us to stay inside right now, but if you're in your own area, if you're not going to a place where there's a ton of people, like I went on a nature trail the other day, which are always pretty barren to be quite honest. I mean, that stuff is still okay. That stuff is still 
free reign and honestly necessary to stay grounded and to stay just completely sane during this time. So even if it's just out on your balcony, enjoy. I'd say someone is pretty stocked up for this uh, whole thing, aren't you, honey? Her little avocado pizza bed. Hello, so it is raining and I am in the car right now. I'm about to go leave and go pick up dinner from our favorite deli from my boyfriend and I. Hashtag support local businesses because everybody and their brother is like having issues with like leaving their house right now. So if you can go and support a local business by getting takeout, honestly, I heard that that's okay and I'm taking the precautions. Obviously, not sick, nobody freak out. But yeah, I just need to get out of the house, honestly. Just leaving your little space, even if it's to go outside, food or something like that, it really can bring your sanity level from like not okay to like decently well. So that's what we're gonna go do. Oh, yeah. There's none for you. Oh. <laughs> So as you guys see, it is raining outside. So I'm truly just taking this time to really embrace the coziness of this whole self quarantine thing. And just, I don't know, embracing the whole nurturing sense that we all need to really embody right now. Took some really cool pictures because I bought some sunflowers just kind of to pick up my mood the other day. And of course they're beautiful and I think everybody else can share that beauty. So I'm editing those right now. Insert the final product here. And of course on my Instagram, which you should find follow if you do not already but yeah I don't know I think we'll just end things here because it's gonna be a pretty cozy night I can already tell but thank you guys so much for watching and just hanging out with me and also just being so supportive on my Instagram and on my videos and just I don't know I feel like everybody's really coming together right now and truly that is kind of the beauty that still remains throughout all of this is that we are so lucky to have technology it's all of these great resources that really make communicating and connecting with people just so easy even if we you know we have different things we have to do right now that make it so we can't be the most in touch with people so you know what I'm talking about I hope this video brought you guys some joy so if it did make sure to give the video a thumbs up I really appreciate it I'm really trying to put out more content for you guys so I can keep you entertained during this whole fiasco but in the comments below if you have any video suggestions that you want to see from me but otherwise I hope to see you guys in a later video bye for now say goodbye say bye <laughs>